Correct. Now let's come back and see the next preparation of alkenes. So very interesting reaction here. Let's see. Here we are going to prepare alkenes by reducing the COOH group of fatty acid. The long chain fatty acid is a whatever long chain fatty acid which we are going to take. The, the, that particular carboxylic group or the COOH group from there we are going to take out. We are going to reduce it to, to prepare an alkene. Right. So before going into that reduction, whenever you see reduction I said you need to use or you should have a reducing agent present in that. So basically in chemistry we have two categories of reducing agents. So when I say reducing agents. So remember this. So we have two categories, type 1 category and type 2 category. What are they? Type 1 category are reducing agents are like lithium aluminium hydride, sodium borohydride. So what, what do they do? Basically type 1 category reducing agents, they are going to always reduce, suppose if I take an aldehyde like this, they are going to reduce aldehyde into primary alcohol. That means what is this primary alcohol? It is nothing but R, C, H, O, H. What happened? R is here, C is here, H is here. This particular thing, uh, addition, reduction is nothing but addition of hydrogen. The bond is broken and hydrogen is added. So, what should you remember? Whenever you have such type of reducing agents, aldehydes are going to get converted into primary alcohols. Suppose if you go with the second category of reducing agents like zinc amalgam HCl or when you take reducing agents like your HI, what do they do? They are going to convert ketones RCH3, COCH3. This is an aldehyde, this is a ketone. They are going to convert ketones into what happens? This is going to break and it will convert into C, CH2, CH3. That means whenever there is a ketone like this, R, C, O, R, okay, R prime if I take, this is going to convert into R, C, H2 in this direction. This way. It's going to convert into an alkene. Remember this. This C agents will convert the uh, the carbonyl group into aldi, uh, primary alcohol. If you find HI or zinc amalgam HCl, you will get converted into an alkane. Right. Now I am going with this basic data. I am going to start showing the reduction. So here with the to which category now HI is belonging to? HI is belonging to category two. Right. Suppose if I take a carboxylic means that particular fat fatty acid. This one I have picked up this acetic acid. Right, then you can also take like this. Now I am going to add HI, isn't it? I said what is the HI category? It belongs to the second category type 2 reducing agents where the acidic group or whatever group is there, that little thing, it is going to convert into, into, into an alkane. Now what am I going to do? I am going to take 6 HIs. So just simple, I am just opening up the reaction and showing you. This is not the exact way but for your understanding, it is like this. Please don't go, this is not the mechanism, I am just showing it to you. Now what happens, first important thing, see here, <coughs> water molecule comes out, this H2 and O, okay. You can take any way, like this H2, this H2, right, fine. So water, now after this how many iodines are there, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, these 6 iodines come out. Right here, how many hydrogens are there? This hydrogen, this hydrogen, and this hydrogen comes out this with this oxygen. These two oxygens are there, isn't it? So how many H two was? Two H two. Now count how many are over? Two to the four hydrogens are over. One, two, three, four. Okay. Now how many are left? Basically, one, two, three, four are over there. I am left with only three. So these three come here. Just see. 2 oxygens are over with this 2 oxygens, 1, 2, 3, 4, okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, 4 are over with this. Now what is left? This is left as CH3, CH3, that's it. Simple, isn't it? Now what is important here? Here you are going to get from acid, you are going to get an alkane. We are going to reduce this, isn't it? I am removing hydrogen. So reduction or removal or reduction of the COOH group of the fatty acid to form alkanes. So what is this alkane? This is ethane. So simple understanding. 1, 2, 3, 4. That is 2 water molecules with this oxygen. 
the leftover 3 come and add here that's coming out as ethane and iodine 6 iodines 3 to the 6.